hello guys welcome back to coding cafe so in this tutorial we will create this pagination.php file so we will open up a new file and we will save this file in the functions folder and its name will be pagination.php click save so now in this file we will open up a php tag and uh, over here we will create a variable query and it will be equals to select all from the posts and uh, the post table and uh, then we will create a variable result and it will be equals to my sqli underscore query and then we will pass the total connection variable and then the total query variable so now we will count the total record so for that we will get a variable total underscore post and it will be equals to my sqli underscore num underscore post and it will be equals to my oh note my it will be we, in this num post we will pass the dollar uh, results variable so now we will use the seal function to divide the total records on every page so for that we will create a variable total underscore pages and it will be equals to c e i l seal and then total underscore post will be divided by per underscore page variable so that's why we create this per underscore page on the functions dot php and now so now we will start the post from the first page so we will type echo and then inside here we will open up the center tag and after that we will open up a div and its class will be equals to pagination and then inside this div we will open up a herf tag and it will be equals to home.ph and then page will be equals to 1 and uh, over here we will type first we are uh, giving a link to go back to the first page okay so don't confuse over here and after that we will we will close the center and the div tag after this for loop so for and if i is uh, equals to 1 and then i is less than or equals to the dollar total pages and then we will just type i plus plus and the code will be we will just type echo echo and uh, then we will open up a herf tag and it will be equals to the home.php question mark dollar page and then the dollar i variable so it will automatically create our numbers then we will just close that and then dollar i and then we will close the a tag and now we will create a link to the last page so we will type echo and then a herf will be equals to the the home.php file and then dollar page not dollar page question mark and then page and it will be equals to total underscore pages 
and uh, then we will just type last page then we will close that here tag and then that div over here this div and then the ahrf tag and now let's design this so uh, over here we will open up a style tag oh just remove that type equals to css so over here we will type dot pagination and then the a tag inside this pagination div the a tags okay so we will design first that so its color will be black and uh, float will be on the left side padding will be 8px 16px and then text decoration will be none and then drawn section will be we will just type background and then hyphen color and then we will have dot 3s and that's it and then we will type dot pagination and then the again the a tag and now we will remove the hover i mean the underliner so we will just activate and then background color will be hashtag ddd then close that so on the home.php i just remove that comment takes from here and just save it and get back to the function.php and let's just check the code for the last time so now let's just save all of that and now if we refresh our page we have only one post in the database so the problem is the image is now not showing so let's check it what will be the problem change this no to dollar content i just check my old code so over here we need to change this to dollar content and uh, now let's refresh our page so guys i will tell you i will change this to dollar content if we just change this to no and if we make some post hello world and if we post it then there will be showing no so now if we just delete this post and refresh our page and change oh change this to dollar content again and if we refresh our page we get some error on the line 17 we will just fix that so now if we just type hello world and then anything can be posted now it is just showing the text and if we just go back to the post table there is our post content so that's why we change that to content or content so call to undefined function my sql i num post line 17 okay let's back to the line 17 my sql i num i think it will be rows and now if we refresh our 
browser we got another error on line 17 and remove that s because the variable is only results now if we refresh our page here is our pagination now there are no more pages so it will only show the first page because it is only one page but the image is still not working so let's see why it's not working guys we will provide the source code in the description to check it out if you got any kind of errors so I'm just checking this not this one this one okay so underscore so guys the content and the image post is saving in to our database and also the textual post but only the image if I just select and just post so it is our post but the name didn't save in the database so I'm still finding the errors so I just delete all of the post and now let's add some photo and it's still not working and now we didn't select anything so if we click post it's just updating the post so I got the solution for that because we didn't add an double equal over here so now if we just save this and refresh our page and click both now it's just saying that error while uploading and the image is not upload so we still have some errors so guys this will not fix the error but we need to add a or die so i will already wrote it so i just paste it okay so if the connection was not established then we will just say connection was not established okay guys so finally 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 i just found that errors and it says we that miss the underscore over here oh so now let's check this out in our browser if we refresh our page and our table is also empty so let's upload this image or this one and if we click on the post then here is our image and if you remember we already designed this in the previous videos okay over here all of the post image and single post and all of that so that's why that is looking so beautiful so watch the previous video if you didn't design it and there is our comment button and all of that and let's type another or insert another post and uh, hello world and then we will select this image if we click on the post button okay then here is our latest post hello world and then the image and if we just add on your textual message we will just type anything and if you click on the post button and here is our post and if also we have check our database it is all of our post and also the image post folder is all of our images and uh, now it's working so guys uh, this is it for this video and in the next video we will show the user post over here on the profile.php file so take care and uh, if you are new to our channel then subscribe our channel coding cafe and press the bell icon thank you guys for watching